Y'all already know what it is. Y'all already know who it is. It's your boy Trigger Happy, aka Authentic Conversation, back with your quick world of entertainment news. And yeah, we gotta talk about it, y'all. Beyonce, Little Nas X, Bone Thugs and Harmony. Yeah, we finna blend in this connection, and it has to do with country music, okay? So let's start with Little Nas X, man. Little Nas X weighs in on Beyonce's Cowboy Carter and says he wished he experienced the same success when doing country music. If you can recall, most of us was introduced to Little Nas with his number one Hot 100 Billboard hit, Old Town Road. It's important to note that it spent 19 weeks on top. While speaking with BBC, pause, Little Nas stated he was happy at the success Beyonce and other black artists were having in the country genre, but wishes his experience was the same. Quoting, but I wish this would have happened for me. I wasn't able to experience this, he said. It's no secret that Little Nas' Old Town Road is still the longest running number one on the Billboard Hot 100 chart. However, it was excluded from the country charts for not having enough country elements. Beyonce was not welcomed with open arms into the country genre either. Many country radio stations refused to play the music. However, her album was still able to go number one on Billboard's country album charts. So yeah, man, that boy Little Nas X, he say he's happy for the success of the black country artists on the charts. But you know, his song was excluded. They said it didn't have enough country elements. And I think it did have enough country elements. You know, they that was just them being, I'm white and I say so. You know, they trying to gatekeep our genre and uh, Beyonce cracked it open. He still had a lot of success with Old Town Road. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I was rocking with Old Town Road. You know, I just don't like being lied to, but that's another story. And uh, the reason why I brought up Bone Thugs and Harmony is because they came out with a country song as well in 98 called Ghetto Cowboy. And this was a perfect depiction of black cowboys they used the hollywood set for the video shout out to crazy bone the brains behind the whole song it was a good storytelling country western song you know with some rap elements and a lot of country elements if y'all listen to that song y'all know what i'm talking about it went platinum but also like old town road it did not make it on the country charts it was excluded from the uh, country charts and I don't know the reason why, but I'm thinking it's the same reason why Little Nas X song wasn't. They said it didn't have enough country elements. And uh, Beyonce being just as big as she is, she was able to bust right through it and get on the top of the charts. And Shibuzi as well. Shout out to Shibuzi with the bar song, Tipsy. It knocked Beyonce off the throne. And that's sitting at number one on the country charts. So yeah, man, shout out to Beyonce, shout out to Nas X, shout out to Shibuzi, shout out to country music, man. We need more country, black country artists to pop out, you know? All right, y'all, we about to get up out of here, man. This is your boy, Trigger Happy, AKA Authentic Conversation. And this is Authentic Voice Radio, Media Game TV, Mech Illis TV. And can y'all do me a favor? Hit that like button, share, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment. All of it's welcome. And I'm gonna get back at y'all with the next video. I'm out.